Good morning and welcome to Tweet of the Week. I am joined today by a published author who also happens to be a student at Crestwood Middle School. This is Mashani Da Silva and she is holding a book that she authored and got published. Um, but we did say you used a pen name and you want to talk a little bit about the pen name you chose? Um, I chose Tiana Da Silva because my middle name is Tiana. So just in case when I get older, I'm like a little embarrassed about my book. It's under a pen name, so yeah. I don't think you will be embarrassed about your book. Um, obviously, your writing will get more sophisticated as you grow older, but this is incredibly exciting because, Mishani, you told me that this wasn't like a teacher made you do this. This was just something you, because you enjoy it so much, want it to do? Yes. So when did you start your book? I started writing in on August 8th, and I finished around November 3rd. So several months of effort going into this. Where did the idea come from? In third grade, I wrote, like, I, I wouldn't consider it a book, and maybe like a short story, and I took ideas from that and made this. So, like, I made it, I grew on the idea. And so you've been building on an idea that started when you were in elementary school. This is fascinating to me, your creative journey, and now you've expanded it out. You have a whole book here, and it's called Midnight. You want to talk just a little bit, because we don't want to give away everything, because we want people to read it. but. What is Midnight about? So there's a good answer for this in the introduction. I'll read it. Okay. What if you met a criminal who was not only a murderer that could change forms, but a cursed, handsome man? Evelyn is a girl who lives a very normal, average life. She'll never be the same after she meets Jaden, a mischievous yet special cardinal who changes her life forever. Who is he? What does he want from me? And why does he keep coming back? Oh, intriguing. <laughs> What a great teaser to get people to want to read Midnight. And so I know that your teacher, Mrs. Grossnickel, tweeted about you becoming this published author. Are there other books in the works? Yes, I've just started my next book. Um, it doesn't really, it needs a lot of work. I only have like a basic idea of what it's going to be about. Now, after you did all of this creative writing and you, you put this together, did you have someone who kind of read it and gave you feedback on it? Yeah, my parents helped me edit and my sister also helped me. My sister also did the cover. So. Oh, so your sister's an artist and did that for yes. you? Yes. Fabulous. Now, sister, okay, did, did, was she like blatantly honest with you about the book? Did yes. she give you good feedback? Yeah. And did you make any changes based on her feedback? Yes. Well, that's amazing because sometimes, you know, people might just say, yeah, that's my sister and I'm not going to pay attention, but it's good that she gave you candid feedback and I can't wait to read Midnight and I am so very proud of you for taking and applying your skills outside of school to do something that you love and I have a feeling that you may have to stick with that pen name because I think great things are going to come from you in the future and, you know, you don't, you're not going to want to lose that. So thank you so much for being here. Ms. Grossnickel, thank you for tweeting about this amazing accomplishment by one of our middle school students. I hope everyone will look for Midnight by Tiana Da Silva and check it out so we can find out why Jaden keeps showing up. Thank you for joining us on Tweet of the Week and we'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.